Hey everyone, Surreal K9 here. Welcome back for more Disgaea 4 Promise Revisited. In the last episode, we recruited a whole bunch of DLC characters, including uh, three new generic classes, which is pretty rad. In this episode, we are going to finish off the DLC characters. It's probably going to take about half an hour given our, uh, given our pace on previous encounters. So, let's go! First up, Prognosticator. I think this is going to be Pram. It's Pram. Pram is the Oracle Overlord from Makai Kingdom. Uh, she made a prophecy that uh, about Zeta that ultimately turned out to be self-fulfilling. <laughs> She beat up her father when she was two years old and stole his netherworld. She loves ice magic. So yeah, if you need a caster, look no further than her. Everybody wants their fortune told. <laughs> no kidding. Aww, don't break Desco's heart. You're so mean, Pram. <laughs> or she could just be trolling. She likes bows and staves, but look at that 99% ice aptitude. That is where you want her. 150% int. So, yeah. Stick her with ice magic, never look back. That's what I say. Imizel, give your fellow caster a fire-based welcome. Heck yeah. I think we have a new recruit for our item world party. She was just trolling. <laughs> I'm not entirely sure that's what she meant.
Hmm. Interesting. Very... Can't roll my R's. <laughs> okay, moving on. Logistics support. I have no idea. I have no idea who you are. She is a medic. Oh yeah, this is one of the uh, one of the uh, guest classes. your name? Ren Ren. She's a nurse. Oh, is she just a generic nurse? Okay. Ooh, she's a dancer! Awesome! I totally want one in my party. Totally! Look at that! This is awesome! I'll show you sardine power! You! You are totally in! Yeah, I think Shut up, Fenric. I like her. Jealous puppy is jealous. <laughs> okay, well, that was a welcome surprise. Yeah, we didn't automatically uh, get one, but we can recruit one. Your soul is mine. Is this the other uh, guest class? Oh, hey, it's a it's a song from Makai Kingdom.
You're, uh, the... Majorita from Disgaea 5! What are you doing here? Meet the Necromancer. To she totally looks like Majorita. I think. But uh, anyway. Necromancer. She uses fists, guns, and stabs. Brings back defeated enemies as zombies and use them. When defeated, come back as a zombie. It totally is Majorita. So, uh, yeah. Hmm. I don't really have a lot to say about this class, though. It doesn't really look all that appealing, but, I mean, whatever. Whoop! Zombie! Please brace yourself. This is good. I guess paired up with a healer, she could be uh, somewhat beneficial, but it's kind of hard to say for sure. So yeah, that is the two guest classes taken care of. Earnest Girl. wonder who this is. It's Morona! Hey there, Morona! I missed you. So yeah, Morona is the protagonist of Phantom Brave. Uh, she summons phantoms into objects to summon allies to her aid. It was a very cool mechanic for a very unique sort of a strategy game. <laughs> Valvator is now officially impressed. So yeah, uh, Morona is primarily a healer. So if you don't like Artina, don't like Rutil, don't like Flan, use Morona. She's pretty good at what she does. Spears and Stavs. Increase stats by 5% per ally spirit unit on the map. So yeah, 140% int and res aptitudes. Ooh, she knows Heliotrope. And Psycho Burgundy, and also Chartreuse. Interesting, she's been learning from her friends. Take this. Morona, welcome to... Welcome to the team! Are we gonna get Ash too? Ooh, what about Castile? <laughs> Val's pet project.
Okay, next character. Sardine interview? What? Oh wait, is Morona gonna gonna confine Ash to the sardine? Yep! <laughs> <laughs> That's great. That's really great. <laughs> Ash is Morona's partner in Phantom Brave. The other protagonist. He was your uh, he was your primary attacker, at least until you uh, recruited some generic phantoms. He draws power from the water dragon in order to protect Morona. But only in Japan. In, a, in America, he has a solemn oath that he falls back on to give him strength. It's a thing. Swords and axes. His only mission is pr to protect Morona. 140% attack aptitude. Stats doubled on the last turn of a magic change. Cool. So yeah, Ash and Gig together uh, would make quite the combo, I imagine. I'll show you sardine power. <laughs> that animation again. Is that so? He she says. <laughs> <laughs> Go 
Go take a shower, Ash. Seriously. Okay, final character. Absolute victory! Unlosing Ranger! Hirohiko Ichimonji is a supporting character in Zetai Hero Project, Unlosing Ranger vs. Dark Death Evil Man. He got ran over by a car on the in the first two minutes of the game. So he had to pass his uh, ranger belt on to some random bystander who became the main character. The absolute victory unlosing ranger is known for his raw determination. <laughs> I don't know, you can't lose you can't use the unlosing ranger for biosuit duping. So yeah, he uses fists, spears, and axes. Let's see, stats increase by 50% when activated, what's that mean? I guess it's a, I guess it's a class skill he has, I have no idea. Oh well, I'm sure I'll have it figured out by the by the time we do the demo videos. For now, welcome to the team, I'm Losing Ranger. <laughs> Being compared to Axel, ouch. So yeah, that is the DLC characters. <laughs> Next time on Disguise 4, we are going to be talking to her at a time traffic shop. We got two extra scenarios to, uh, to handle, and this is where it's at. I hope to see you all then. Bye-bye for now.